I'm Anil Kumar sharing with you test problems on trigonometric functions. Here are two similar kind of functions. We need to rewrite, the first one is, rewrite 2 cos square 4x minus 1 as a single trigonometric ratio. The second one is, rewrite tan x divided by square root of 1 plus tan square x as a single trigonometric ratio. You can pause the video, answer the questions and then look into my suggestions. Now for the first one that reminds you of the double angle formula which is cos of 2 theta equals to 2 cos square theta minus 1. So you can apply this formula and solve the equation. Correct. In the second one 1 plus tan square x is equal to secant square x. You can use this Pythagorean identity to solve. So now you can actually pause and then solve and find the solution. Okay. Now let's begin solving these equations. Now I'll use this formula cos 2 theta equals to 2 cos square theta minus 1. And in our case what we have is that theta equals to 4x. So in our case theta is 4x, right? So we have theta as 4x. Now if theta is 4x, then I get 2 cos square 4x minus 1. So 2 theta will be how much? 2 theta will be equals to 8x. Do you see that? So we'll apply this formula, which is cos 2 theta equals to 2 cos square theta minus 1. Now theta equals to 4x, that is the solution. 2 theta is 8x, so we can write this as cos of 2 theta which is 8x 8x do you see that so you can rewrite the given expression as cos of 8x right that is 2 times 4x using this formula let's do the next one here as I have said 1 plus tan square x equals to secant square x so we can rewrite the expression as tan x over square root of secant square x. Now that gives us tan x could be written as sine x over cos x. Let me do it in the next step. Let me first write this as tan x over secant square x square root will be secant x. Correct. Now tan x can be written as sine x over cosine x and secant x is 1 over cos x. Now cos x and cos x cancel out, right? So we are left with sin x. So the given expression can be written as sin x. So that is how you can write them as a single trigonometric ratio. I hope that helps. Thank you.